Hey, good afternoon, everybody. It's J.P. Murray with The Murray Company. We're talking sponsorships today. Sponsorship pricing, sponsorship packages. Man, I tell you what, I've been talking to a number of associations about this over the last 48 hours. I think three or four different associations. So let's, let's dive in real quick. The first thing to think about as you're developing your price structure is what is the value? What is the value of what you're offering to three different constituencies? What's the value to you, the association, in terms of how much money you're going to get out of it and what you see as important? Secondly, how valuable is this platform, this sponsorship opportunity to the sponsor itself? Okay. Then thirdly, that we sometimes forget about is how valuable is this to the audience, to the people that are going to be benefited by the sponsorship or see the content or whatever it might be. Those three audiences help determine the value of the price. Let's take a coffee break, for example. Maybe high value for the association because they don't want to spend their own money on it. Less valuable to the sponsor uh, and maybe not very valuable at all to the, to the attendee because they had coffee back at the hotel room. Value low. Whereas a fantastic speaker, maybe one of the best in the industry, high value to the association because they want great content, high value for the sponsor because they know everyone's going to be watching, and third, high value to the audience because they're going to see a great program. Increased price. Okay, so get be very truthful, very truthful around the value of the sponsorship program. The second thing we need to think about is the data. The data, how what does the data say about the pricing? Now, are you comparing your pricing with other associations that sponsors might be also uh, engaged with? How does your pricing match up? with other associations in your space? How uh, does your data tell you things about what's been sold in the previous events, the previous programs, what's been tough to sell, what's been difficult, where's the band in terms of where your sponsors tend to buy from you? That value combined with your data is going to give you a pretty good sense of where your pricing might need to be. Let's talk about sponsorship packages. Hey, I've, I've been a big fan of this for a while, and that is organizing your sponsorship packages by the business objectives or priorities of the sponsor. That could be access to people, access to VIPs, very valuable, may want to pay a premium. Okay, it may be uh, content delivery. Oh my goodness, do people want to give speeches now? Do they want to deliver content to your members through webinars? Great sponsorship packages. So access, thought leadership, and then maybe the final one could be some traditional branding opportunities, logo placement, ads, things like that. What are the business objectives of the sponsor? Cluster your sponsorship packages that way. The other way that I'm starting to really become a fan of is organizing your sponsorship packages by the type of audience that you're going to reach. C-suite people, uh, buying managers, uh, people in charge of procurement, right? Tell the story in your prospectus about the type of people that this sponsorship is going to reach because that person needs to go back to their corporate office and tell the story about, hey, we need to buy this sponsorship because it's going to get our target demographic. So that's pricing, that's packages. I want to tell you a little bit about what my team is telling me is the uh, kind of the most attractive sponsorships right now. It's thought leadership, the opportunity to speak, the opportunity to introduce speakers, the opportunity to be on the podium has a premium. The toughest thing to sell right now, mobile apps, <laughs> doesn't mean you shouldn't do them, but mobile apps and wireless service in the hotel. Part of that is probably because the price differential goes like this and some people, uh, there's lack of uniformity in uh, selling your, your mobile access at an event. 
We also know that our strategic partners and your strategic sponsors want a 365 year-long strategic conversation with you. So I hope you provide it to them. Hey, we're going to take these topics on in a big-time direct way on May the 18th, complimentary seminar for everyone in the association space. So tell your friends. We're going to break down for 30 minutes some of the best tactics and methods for pricing and packages and then how to sell them. I hope you'll join me. Go to murraycompany.com to get all the registration information you need. And by the way, I've got videos and blogs up there about sponsorship, pricing, and sales that might be valuable to you. So, that's our topic today. Pricing, packages, and what's hot and what is not in sponsorship sales. Hey, best of luck for you. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.